Hi, in this video I would like to go over some of the newest features in Chime for Link version 2.5. So in this version we have um, improved our support for the Office 365 platform. We've also included a few new virtual agents that can be downloaded and used out of the box. We have made various updates to our Enterprise IAM alert functionality. And in this demo, I'll go over how to send an alert and what some of the new features are that we have added. The first enhancement to alerts I'd like to show you is that you can now send an alert in more than one language. So before you could only send an alert in um, pretty much just in one language, but with this update, you can have one um, version of the alert in English, and you can also configure um, an alert in an additional language. So I'm going to add an alert that will be sent in French. So now that I've configured my alert to be sent in English and French, the next step would just be choosing the alert recipients. We've also added a new feature here which allows you to whitelist the Active Directory groups that show up in this list. So if you wanted to select um, certain Active Directory groups to choose from um, so that all of your groups don't show up here, then you can do that with whitelisting. Once you've chosen your alert recipients, the next step would um, just be some additional options. You could have the alert sent as a desktop alert, um, so that would show up on the user's desktop as opposed to IM, but that is optional. The last step is choosing if you want the alert sent now or later. You can set an expiration date and you can also send it as a high priority or normal priority alert. Once that alert has been configured and sent out, it's going to pop up on the user's desktop as a normal Skype for Business or Link IM. And as you can see, I have configured this alert in both, both English and French. So both the English and French versions have shown up on my screen. So once that alert has started to be sent out, we have some additional information that's available to you so that you can track the alert. So we have some charts available that might show you things like how the alert was delivered. So you might wanna know if the alert was delivered through an IM, through email, if we fall back to email, or if it was not delivered. We also show a report of who received the alert, when they received it, and we'll also tell you whether they received it um, through email, whether it was not sent, um, and pretty much every option that you could have there. So um, I hope you enjoyed this demo of um, our Chime for Link 2.5 updates. Thanks for watching.